let us discuss the last question of the paper. This is a, um, a question based on decision making. You are the head of a relief committee. The committee has been given the responsibility of providing relief material to flood hit areas in a certain district. You are about to start the distribution of the relief materials when the local MLA urges you to distribute the materials in his area first. You know that the area which the MLA is talking about is not seriously affected as compared to the areas as compared to the other areas. So what will you do in such a situation? Will you pay heed to the MLA's request and start distributing the relief materials in his area? Well, uh, option A is not correct because um, we know that MLA's area is not seriously affected and hence the area should not be prioritized at any cost. So definitely option A cannot be taken into account. Ignore the MLA's request and act according to your own whims and wishes. This is again incorrect because simply ignoring the request of the MLA and acting as per your own whims and wishes is not the right idea. Uh, this is uh, this is not uh, this will not show you as a responsible officer because as the head of the relief committee one is not supposed to act according to his own wishes and whims the decisions need to be taken uh, seriously they need to be implemented only after serious deliberations and you know taking stock of all the situation around so you cannot simply ignore and act as per your own wish. Politely explain to the MLA that other areas have been more seriously affected than his area and so the first phase of distribution would start with the worst affected area. Yes, this is appropriate solution. This is an appropriate solution because um, uh, it is possible that that MLA uh, might not be aware of the extent of damage in the other areas and therefore he is asking uh, the relief materials to be distributed in his area which is not as much affected so uh, it is a good idea to politely explain him the exact situation and then decide upon it start distributing the relief materials in the worst affected areas and simultaneously make arrangements so that additional relief materials are sent to the MLA's areas as early as possible this is also a, uh, a suitable solution that you you are still in this case you're still prioritizing the worst affected areas first and simultaneously you're making quick arrangements for the additional relief materials to be sent to the MLA MLS areas area so this is also a very good solution this will ensure that uh, the distribution uh, of the relief materials reach every flood area the worst ones and the not so worst ones the worst uh, not so uh, the areas which are not that badly affected so the answer is options c and d